Uh, Rain Happy pulled up okay from Cranbourne. Um, Jamie reported to me that uh, he might have, he might have just, I don't know whether he was just girthed up a bit tighter. He just, uh, he didn't really stretch out. And uh, to, to her credit, she gave him every chance to try and um, to race in a, in a position where there wasn't too much around him. And um, he still, uh, he was a little bit disappointing down the straight considering he didn't have that much around him, but um, seems to have pulled up well. Uh, he's another one that uh, we're going to have to um, really change our focus on and, and uh, we've, we've been able to keep him fresh and, um, uh, and poke, poke around with him and that really is the best way to have him. When we sort of train him a little bit, so to speak, he, uh, he, uh, he, he's vulnerable to get, uh, get viruses and get sick and uh, he has had a few, a few of those over his career. So um, that's something to be mindful of. But I think we have to step him out in distance again, possibly just to 13 or 1400 and uh, try and get him to roll along in front and um, set up a tempo that suits, um, suits his uh, way of racing. Um, uh, it just requires a little bit more uh, attention to detail to get him there and as you're aware it, it has happened before and he has got sick so that's my concern but um, with uh, limited options to uh, go to the races that really suit him at the moment with um, uh, the racing the way it is then I think that's what we have to do to continue his um, preparation so um, he'll probably step out to 1200 and then 13, 1400 his next two starts and uh, hopefully we can push him out and get him to run along in front.